What is up? My name is Mysterium Effects, and welcome to this brand new intro template. Um, in order to make it say your name, we're gonna have to follow the following steps. The first step is right click on the first layer of text. Um, if when you right click it, it'll be surrounded by yellow, I think, but I have a different theme on, so it's surrounded by white. So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna press Tab backspace it a lot and then write in your text now I'm press tab again in order to confirm the edit that you just made now right click the second layer of text hiding over there and press tab backspace it a bunch and then write in your text um, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go view and then camera uh, so from here uh, you can play the animation But, uh, hey, the text is too big, so what you gotta do is click here and go to frame 188. Um, now hold down shift and right click, then press S and then move it towards the center. Um, now press I and then press on scaling. So um, now, as you can see, it looks. Um, <clears throat> Voice crack. Looks a lot better. And uh, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna skip to frame 189, and um, that's where the text switch happens. So you're gonna right click on this text, press tab, backspace it a bunch once again, and write in your second text. Um, of course, you can make it bigger if it's too small. Um, so, um, in order to make it bigger, because, um, evidently mine's a bit small. Actually, maybe it is. Maybe it's just fine. Yeah, 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 it's fine. Um, but, so I guess that wraps it up. Actually, wait, no, it, it, it doesn't wrap it up. Um, you have to go on this camera icon thingy. Uh, if you use a Mac, you're good to go. You can just press render, then animation, then boom. Your intro is rendering. It'll probably be done in about an hour. However, if you use Windows, you got a little, you got um, a bit of changing to do. So you're gonna click on QuickTime over here, and go to H.264. You're not done yet. You gotta go down to Encoding. Click on the arrow and click the audio codec AAC. So now that you've done that, you can press Render and Animation and. Um, just sit back for an hour, I guess, and do something productive not on your computer. Unless you have a phone, in which case you can just do something not productive there. Well, um, that's it for this tutorial, guys. I hope you enjoyed, because I enjoyed recording this. Okay, that's a lie, but I did enjoy making the intro. And um, I will see you guys later.